Here's our real consumer question from a real consumer. Tori writes, Dale, I got a message on my computer that said I have a dangerous virus infecting my computer and I need to call the customer support number on the screen immediately. So I called them and their customer service people charged me $200 to fix the issue. And the computer now works, but they also subscribed me for a monthly fee to keep monitoring my computer. Now I don't know if I should keep trusting them. Do you know about these virus monitoring companies? Tori, I am familiar with them. Unfortunately, they're virtually all scams. A couple of years ago, the Federal Trade Commission got more than 150,000 complaints about these phony tech support companies. Yes, there are true virus protection software companies, but not the ones that take over your computer and tell you that you must call them. They have messages like, warning, you must contact us immediately so that our expert engineers can walk you through the removal process over the phone to protect your identity. Please call us within the next five minutes to prevent your computer from being disabled or from any information loss. Immediate warning, call us now. These are not legitimate companies. Unfortunately, you might get locked out of your computer and not be able to use the internet for a while. But don't panic and do not call the phone number on your screen or click on any links they provide. The supposed help line is a company who is scaring you into giving them all your credit card information. Don't do it. These fake tech support companies will likely also ask you for your computer password and remote access to your computer so they can fix the problem that they created. So to recap, if you get a suspicious warning on your computer, don't call the phone number on your screen. But if you don't already have a good virus protection on your computer to prevent the fake problems and a pop-up screen locks your internet, it may take you a while to get your computer working again. Of course, try rebooting your computer, or you might have to use your phone or another computer to find the steps needed to get rid of the issue. And if you did call the company on your screen about the warning, you need to make sure your credit card company knows, and you also need to update your security software. Thanks, Tori, for the question.